Hi guys! Welcome back to Crafty Kids. In this video, we will be seeing how to make an origami card. So let's get started. So first, for this activity, we need a square piece of paper. So I'm going to be making a yellow card. So I'm taking a yellow piece of paper. You guys can take any color you like. So the first step is that we're supposed to fold the paper in half like this. Now we have to fold the paper in half on the opposite side. Next step is that we are supposed to fold both sides of the paper, all sides of the paper to the middle point. Like this. So after we complete this, we have to fold any two opposite sides of the paper to the middle line like this. Now we have to unfold it and we have to fold the other two opposite sides to the middle line. So after we are done, we have to unfold them and we have to open any two sides of the paper like this. Now we have to fold both sides of the paper to the middle line. Then we will have a structure like this. So the next step is that we have to take the bottom part and we have to fold to the top so that a triangle will be formed on the top like this. So now we have to repeat the same step but we have to take the top part and we have to fold to the bottom so that a triangle will be formed on the bottom. So I am repeating the same step on the opposite side of the paper as well. So after we complete this, I am opening the box and I'm keeping any two of my fingers in here and I am pressing on it so that this part will come in. So now we have to repeat the same step on the opposite side as well. So after we complete this, we will have a box like structure. So I have already posted a video in my channel about how to make a paper box. So you guys can watch this for more information. So now we have to make two more boxes like this in the same way. Now we will have three boxes. So now I am taking a glue bottle and I am applying some glue on the corner part of the paper here. So after we complete this, I am sticking another box and I am sticking it to it. Like this. So now I am turning to the opposite side and I am pressing it so that it sticks well. So now we have to turn it back and I am taking the third box and I am applying some glue on the top part here. So we have to do this slowly on the top part here. So after we complete this, I am taking this part and I am sticking it on top of this. So we have to give it some time to dry and it might take some time as well. So we should leave it for about 5 minutes. So afterwards the dry, we have to take two rectangular strips of paper of the same color. So I am taking yellow because my card is yellow in color and we are supposed to stick this on the sides of the paper like this. So I am applying some glue on the paper. Now I am sticking this onto the card. So after we complete this, we have to apply some glue on another paper as well. And we have to stick this paper onto the opposite side of the card. So now I am sticking this onto the opposite side. So after we are done with this, I made four black circles like this. So you guys can make it and cut them out. So now I am just going to be applying some glue on the circles and I am going to be sticking them onto the card. So we have to stick it on the bottom of the card like this. So we have to do this on all the sides of the paper. So after we are done sticking, I cut out a rectangular small piece of paper out of blue paper. So you guys can take any color you like and I am applying some glue behind this paper. And we have to stick this paper 
onto the front part of the card like this so after we complete this i'm taking a black marker and i'm just going to be drawing a oval like structure on the bottom part of the card here and i'm going to be taking a red marker and i'm just going to be drawing two circles two oval circles on the top part of the paper so now our paper card is ready so you can put more information on it if you'd like so i hope you guys enjoyed this video and i'll see you guys next time on crafty kids so before i conclude please subscribe to my channel if you haven't done yet like share and comment also press the bell icon so that you'll get a notification whenever i upload a video bye